today, I'm gonna to show you how I turn $1 into millions of dollars. And it's actually extremely simple. So easy that most of you probably won't even believe it when I show it to you in solid proof. Come on in, let me show you how it works. This right here is my ClickBank account, one of many online accounts I use to collect money from my online businesses. Now we could see here, it averages about two or $300 a day, but it wasn't always like this. I was actually one of the first people to open a ClickBank account back in 1999. And back then I logged in and there was no money for many, many days. But eventually on July 4th of the year 2000, something amazing happened. You see, on July 4th, it wasn't a work day. I actually went down to my dad's house for a barbecue and we made some hot dogs. Some of them were actually burnt, much like this coffee. And when I came home that night, I logged into my ClickBank account just for laughs, expecting to see zeros like normal. But I saw something different. On that day, while I was gone, having fun with my family, I actually made $21 in sales. That's right. I was gone, I was not working, this was automatic passive income. And I know a lot of people talk about passive income as if it's this mystical unicorn that is untouchable by normal people and probably doesn't even exist. But passive income is not a myth, I've seen it. And it's actually built using the exact opposite method of what you would think. And this is exactly how I turned $1 into over 12 million over the past few years. What it is, is something very important. You see, the average person is gonna go out there and if you ask them a question saying, would you rather make $100 today by going to work or would you rather make $1 each day, every day? The vast majority of people are going to tell you that they would rather go to work today and make $100. Why? Because that's something guaranteed they can count on. I get my 100 bucks. Why would I mess around with a dollar? However, what they're failing to realize is the magic of compound interest. Yeah, you ever wonder why your mortgage is so expensive and you end up paying $750,000 for a house that was only 225? It's compound interest. And this starts to build and grow in a crazy way. Because if you go to work and get $100 for today, the problem is you need to go to work again tomorrow to get another $100. However, if I spend eight hours today working on something that is going to put a dollar a day in my pocket each and every day, well then, I'm gonna get that dollar tomorrow, the next day, and on and on we go. Which means the more days I spend making a dollar, the more this compound interest is going to skyrocket. And by the end of about three months, I'll be making $100 a day, but the difference between you and me is I can actually stop working and I still get the $100 each and every day. And the cool part is, this can be done with literally anything. A blog post, a YouTube video, social media, a free report or ebook, and even AI-generated content. What a lot of people are failing to realize is that when people search for things online or use the web, somebody is getting paid. But because they're not getting paid, they fail to see this as a legitimate business. However, if we were to take a look at a keyword that is searched for in Google, mortgage underwriting, which is part of the mortgage process. If you've ever got a mortgage and you know there's an underwriter who has to approve your loan. This means that over 7,900 people each and every month are searching for mortgage underwriting. And we could see here, mortgage underwriting process, what is underwriting in mortgage, how long does mortgage underwriting take, and on and on we go. So if I was to take a keyword like how long does mortgage underwriting take, I could literally do research and write a really good article or video or blog post on this topic in a couple of hours. And with that, I could probably show up on Google for terms related to mortgage underwriting process or how long the process takes. And since we know that this keyword is very closely related to mortgage loan application, which actually gets over $10 a click on Google. Wait a minute, what does that mean? If you were to go to Google and search for mortgage loan application, you're gonna see advertisers like Fairwinds, Best Money, Rocket Mortgage, Bank of America, and on and on we go. 
these advertisers are paying every single time someone clicks on the link to their website. And the amount they're paying is between $10 and $40 for each and every click. That means there's a lot of money in this market. So if I spent today and said, I am going to write the best article, video, or whatever it is about how long mortgage underwriting takes, I can be in front of like 10,000 people a month for a keyword that's getting $10 a click. So let's say that I'm not that great at getting ranked on the search engines, I'm not that great at getting traffic, but my mortgage article is able to get a few people each and every day. If I'm able to get a few people each and every day, and let's say that my mortgage application process, blog post, or video makes an average of $3 a day every day. Well, you have this guy over here saying, Marcus, you have no brain because I went to work and I got $100. You only got three. But what they're failing to realize is that this $3 a day times 365 days a year is an average of $1,000 for one simple little blog post or video that anyone can put online. And now that I have my $1,000 every single year coming in from just focusing on $3 a day, I'm free the next day to make another post and maybe make another $3. Now I'm at $2,000 a day. Or let's say I do a really good job on the next one and this one makes me $15 a day. Again, doesn't sound like much, but an average of just $15 a day is gonna bring me $5,500 each and every year. So by just focusing on these three things and doing really good and only averaging like five to $7 a day on each of them, I'm already over $8,000 a year with just three days of work. Imagine what would happen if I played the odds and I focused on just making a dollar a day every day. By the end of the year, I'd be generating $365 a day or $133,000 a year. And the key here is to focus on things that actually work. Focus on who's searching, who's watching, who's gonna consume the content, and then point them to things that put money in your pocket. And remember, as you start doing this, the income in the beginning is gonna be very slow. If you're making a dollar a day, by the end of the week, you're only gonna have like $7 a day, which isn't much at all. But as time goes on, this is going to skyrocket exponentially and grow your income like crazy. And this is something that you can do for free in a super simple way. And remember, the results are not typical, implied, or guaranteed. Not every blog post is gonna make a dollar a day. Some of them will make a lot more, Many of them will make a lot less. And the average person trying to make money online makes nothing. So remember, this is a business. You wanna learn exactly how this method works and how you can use blogging and video marketing to make passive income online? Check out the link in the description for my $100,000 a year blog profit plan. This free video will walk you through the entire process so that you can start making money online.